May Almighty God bless you all and keep you and take good care of you, protect you through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Stop the killings. Convoke a ceasefire meeting. Save Imo State. Stop the killings. Convoke a ceasefire meeting. Save Imo State. A charge to Governor Hope Ozodima and to all stakeholders. Last year, exactly about this time, I charged Governor Hope Ozodima and other Igbo leaders to protect our people and defend our lands. That charge was provoked by threats and acts of invasion on our farmlands by Fulani herdsmen. Now, our very lives are at stake as killings of Igbo people are taking place in broad daylight and at night by both officially and unofficially armed men. Imo people are on their own from known and unknown gunmen. There is a scare in the air and anxiety on the ground. Imo people are hiding, living in fear. Reports of indiscriminate arrests for no clear reason and killings as a show of power or in alleged retaliation continue to spread. On Wednesday, the 26th of May, 2021, I personally went to the Federal Correctional Center, the Worry Prison, to see the 106 young men arrested from various locations, accused and charged to court jointly for planning to commit a treasonable felony. They are yet to be released. On Thursday, the 3rd of June, just yesterday, 2021, I visited the Oweri Federal Medical Center Mortuary as I painfully surveyed the 35 corpses stuck naked on the bare floor, stealthily dumped there within the last few days, victims of runaway killers, military, police, and unknown gunmen with no identification on them. I thought of many others who have been kidnapped, taken to unknown locations, killed and even butchered as we continue to hear. Emo is bleeding. On behalf of the already killed, and even more on behalf of the living now threatened daily with brutal death, I charge Governor Hopo Zodim as the Chief Security Officer for Emo people to step up and stop the killings by whoever is responsible for them. I equally charge all users and abusers of guns and deadly weapons to stop the killings to renounce violence and to denounce any show of pride in killing fellow human beings. I urge the governor to convoke a ceasefire meeting of all Imo stakeholders, no matter their disposition or leaning for a concerted approach to quench the bloody fire already ravaging Imo people and destroying Imo state. Save Imo people, save Imo state. Into your hands, O Lord, we commend Imo State. O Mary, Mother of Sorrows and Mother of Mercy, intercede for your children. God bless you all.